Greetings to you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I thank you for once again joining me through this Experience God series and I pray that God bless you as you hear these thoughts every week and apply in your lives. I'm sure God is going to talk to you today on something very simple but a very important matter in our life. I always uh, like people when when they do some kind of small small acts of faith right uh, uh, even even I used to do sometimes always uh, uh, say for example we, we start a car and uh, just say a word of prayer or just just think in your heart that God thank you for this God and please protect me when I drive now and come back safely it's, 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 it's a small act of faith and be acknowledging God in our life also uh, I like people when they say a word of prayer or say grace before they start having their meal every day it's 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 all small small things in our life but when we miss that we miss something uh, uh, we miss something very important uh, okay now a question raises I trust in God. I accepted Christ. I, 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 I completely gave my life to God. Um, I do. I go to church. I read Bible. I, I pray long prayers. I fast. I, I, I devote a lot of time to God. So am I not showing my faith completely? The word of God says in the book of James, faith without action is dead the verse never says faith without action is half or 20 percent or 80 percent or, or or mute or something it's simple and straightforward it says faith is dead without action even we might have the faith of a mountain Nobody can able to shake our faith. But unless we apply it in our life, apply it every day in our life, not only where we, 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 uh, we apply that when we are in a times of trouble. Sometimes I see people, they just wait for a time, uh, uh, a trouble in their lives. And, and then they, uh, okay, God, now I got the problem. I'm going to pray. I'm going to show my faith. They just, uh, they just act on it and uh, and declare the the victory in God. No, no, no. Of course, when troubles comes, we have to show our faith in action. But that is not only the time. We have to show our faith every day in our life. Every day, starting from the small, small things to the bigger ones. Yeah, so as I told you, uh, praying, praying before we starting our car acknowledges that we depend on God, we trust in God to help us and protect us when we go out. Remember friends, there is no place in this world which is secure, safe and everything. The world can give you all kinds of security measures, but who knows? Anything can, anything can happen anytime. You cannot trust any machine, any software, any protection, anybody in this world except the one who created us. The creator knows how to protect us. Also, we should, we should understand the small insight today. God bless us with so many things in this world, but when he blesses, he gives all those to us to, for us to use it. Use it effectively for his name. So the word use means we are not the owners of anything. We are the users. God is the owner of everything in this world, including us. So when you buy a car, you... Well, for the world standards, you are owning the car because you are paying the money. But, again, you are not the owner because the money you are paying is not something you create. God has blessed you and gave you that money, that salary, with a job. 
or with the business so everything came from god and god bless you and we say it is we own it no god owns it we are the user so let's show some act of faith in every day in our life acknowledging god for what he did for us let's say a prayer when we come back home uh, enjoying our tour or come back from office and say lord thank you for um, making me to come back safely to home thank you for this entire day just just when you open your laptop unlocking those uh, key unlocking the screen in your office or at your home just say a word of prayer lord thank you for this job you given to me there are so many people who are searching for a job and but you have given me this job graciously let me let me do my work sincerely and give me the knowledge and wisdom and understanding to complete my work and let me get favor in the eyes of everyone just just these are small small acts of faith just just when you see someone in in a, in a trouble in a problem just 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 say to god god give me the strength to help them just go and help them just give them what they need yeah we might be thinking whether oh this this person uh, whether he is really in need or not i need to investigate i need to no 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 if 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 god puts a thought in your heart to help someone immediately help them whether they whether whether they are saying true to you or false or anything that 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 is between them and god but when you are in a position to help someone it is always show that act of faith so friends this is what let uh, this is what the the let's is how we can experience god in our life every day experience god in 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 everything you own in your phone in your car in your in your, in, in in every in your, in your home in every property you have experience god god thank you for giving me this let me let me think about using this for your glory let me think about uh, using my phone for your glory thank you for this salary these are some things we can always do and experience god in our life and god will be so happy to see his uh, creation acknowledging him in all these things Thank you friends thank you for joining with me today and i hope we we start showing our faith in action in even small small things and and definitely god will bless you and god will honor you thank you and have a nice week